In today's lesson, I'm going to be covering how to create a title in Premiere Pro. Um, when you first open up your screen, basically what you will see is you'll have obviously what I call the refrigerator. This is your projects, your media browser, your effects. You have your cutting board where you're going to clip your work um, and your, your filming. Uh, here is your sequence where you're setting everything up and creating and designing. And this is where we'll be watching your projects. Okay, so to make a title, first thing you're going to do is go File, New, Legacy Title. You can name it like beginning title, credits. I'm just going to call it for right now Title 3. I'm going to say OK. Now a box will appear. In this box, uh, depending on what, what um, version you have, your tools will appear. Now, my tools are over here. In order to access your tools, if no tools appear, right here where the three lines are, you can have your tools here. Okay. You can also look at styles. That's this. Actions would be alignment. So I'm going to go back to tools. Now on my tools, I'm going to get my T tool, very similar to Photoshop and Illustrator. I'm going to open it up. Now my, the project I'm working on, summer 2019. I can come in here, I can alter it. Um, you have your alignment, center align, side align. I can change the font, obviously, here, different fonts you can play around with. Another thing that's really fun is I love uh, the sequences or the uh, styles, all these cool styles. Okay. Here is your kerning. So that's the tracking, that's the space between. You want to highlight it. You can track out, track in, that's called kerning. And then also you have your letting, and that is the space between the lines. Okay, all right. Now, in order to have your title move, right here below the new title based or current title, there is a button. It's like four lines and an up and down arrow. Click on that. This is your roll crawl options. So you can have it crawl left, you can have it crawl right, um, roll, and then you have the choice to have it start off screen or end off screen. I'm going to do both, okay, and then say OK. Now, the thing about the title is it will save itself automatically. I'm going to go back here to my program sequence. That's basically like what we call your plate. It's where you watch your show. And then down here in my refrigerator, let's say it was on Media Browser, because that's where I'm getting all my clips. In order to find your title, just click on your projects. Here it is, Title 3. I'm going to grab it, and I'm going to drag it in. Right now, I'm just putting be V1. Bam, right there. Okay. I'm going to start at the beginning, and I'm going to hit Play. There we go. Now, if I wanted to go slower, I'll drag it out. They're really slow. Do, 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 do. Okay. If I want it to roll faster, what do I do? I'm drag it in. And that will create the frames per second for you. Let's see. I might drag it a little bit. Okay. All right. So what I'd like you to do right now is create a title. Definitely uh, change the font, change the color, play around with your roll and crawl, uh, close it out, and then come down to your projects and then drag it into your sequence. If you do not have a sequence, in order to create a sequence, say File, New, Sequence. All right, have some fun. Um, this is the objective for today.